I bet. So I just read an article. You feel me? Like I'm saying, this boxing shit is mad confusing. You feel me? But I don't know if it's a negotiation. I knew that Crawford and Sean Porter they was in negotiation. You feel me? I don't think this is a negotiation. I think man, you just said something. You feel me? And just to walk or to wake up the boxing um 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 world. You feel me? But Manny Pacquiao basically said he want forty million dollars. And we gonna keep this shit up. We gonna keep this shit a hundred. You feel me? We just gonna keep it a stack. You feel me? I'm a fan of Manny Pacquiao. I feel like I I feel like, bro. So my hat goes off to Manny Pacquiao, bro. The nigga is forty something years old or forty years old, and he's stopping top welterweights, bro. Like he's stopping them motherfuckers. Like you feel me? But I feel like forty million dollars. I'm keeping it funky. I feel like it's a duck, bro. I feel like the forty billion dollars. It's a strategic move. If anybody know follow Manny Pacquiao, Manny Pacquiao is 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 a politician, bro. He's smart. He's not stupid, bro. He knows that Bob Arum doesn't want to pay a fucking penny to anyone. So of course he's when by him throwing out forty million dollars during this time during this pandemic, the only fighter I can say that can get forty million dollars during the pandemic is a Mayweather. Manny Pacquiao is Manny Pacquiao. He's well known, but Mayweather is on a whole different level. Like, he's the only fighter that I feel like could come and be like, "Yo, I want forty million dollars to fight Terrence Crawford." And he could get it because he 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 just had that much fans. He niggas hate him so much. Niggas want to see him lose. Nigga, what about really want to see Manny Pacquiao lose? Because he already lost. You feel me? So he's the only fighter that I seen that that could come and earn forty million dollars right now during the pandemic. You feel me? I don't know if, if Anthony Joshua and, Ty, and Tyson Fury and these niggas are going to be able to do that either. You feel me? But I feel like it's a duck because he came out in air and, and, say, and said that, like, Ter um, um, Errol Spence didn't look good against his last fight um, with Danny Garcia, that Errol Spence is slow. So I feel like he threw the $40 million out so to duck Terrence Crawford so he could go and fight. Errol Spence. I feel like it's a strategic move. I feel like this nigga's not stupid. I don't think he want to get in there with, 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 with Terrence Crawford. Because niggas know, bro. Niggas know. Everybody knows. Like, I ain't no fanboy. I'm just keeping it a stack, bro. Everybody knows Terrence Crawford is not the nigga to go in there with. That's why Sean Porter do not want to take $2 million to fight the nigga, bro. When he got $2 million to fight um, um, Errol Spence. He don't want to take the $2 million, you feel me? That's exactly what this nigga Manny Pacquiao doing. He don't want to fight Terrence Crawford. Now, if Bob Arum was supposed to give him that $40 million and a fight was supposed to happen, I don't think we need to be in any debate to see who's going to win or you even in no conversation to see who's going to win because stylistically, that is a bad fight for Manny Pacquiao, my brother. That is not, like, Terrence Crawford is not, I'm going to keep Thurman. Keith Thurman don't have that dog like Terrence Crawford does. Errol Spence don't have that dog like Terrence Crawford does. You feel me? None of these fighters have that dog like, Errol, like Terrence Crawford does. And and if y'all watch Terrence Crawford fight, y'all know what dog I'm talking about. And when Terrence Crawford get hit with a big shot, he comes back. He comes back. And when he comes back, you got to be prepared for when he comes back. Manny Pacquiao, chin is very questionable, bro. He went down. Marquez... Lay him down in the ring for a good 10 minutes. Like, he couldn't even get up. You feel me? And that's Marquez, bro. You about to go in there with a nigga that hit way harder than Juan Marquez, bro. Like, Terrence Crawford, um, knockout rate is very high. I don't think Manny Pacquiao want to do that. You feel me? So, I feel like he going to probably, he going to go go with Errol Spence. You feel me? I feel like that was just a duck. You feel me? But if the fight was supposed to happen, Manny was Manny's going to get destroyed, bro. He's going to get destroyed. And I don't see him having a puncher's chance. None of that. I don't see him have a, a chance in hell to beat Terrence Crawford. I mean, and if if I'm, if I'm if I, if Manny Pacquiao beat Terrence Crawford, I'll be the first person to sit here and make a video and be like, Manny, you got it. I love Manny. All respect to Manny. But, nah, that's a, I feel like that's a duck, bro. Ain't nobody um, is going to get no $40 million right now during the pandemic, bro. Unless you, you are flooding me with them. Mike Tyson on one of these niggas. I don't think you're going to make $40 million, bro, to fight Terrence Crawford, bro. Terrence Crawford is not even a big pay-per-view superstar. Like, and it's not, I'm not going to say that 
because he's not good. Because obviously he's, I feel like he's the best fighter of this generation next to Errol Spence. You feel me? But there's no way, bro. There's no way, bro. It's a duck, bro. It's a duck. He's a politician. He's smart. I think he's like the the mayor or whatever the fuck he is, ambassador in, in the Philippines. He's, he's, he's smart, bro. He's smart. He's not stupid, bro. So he knows by him throwing that out there, it's, it's, a, it's a duck. He knows Bob Arum is not going to pay him $40 million, bro. And Bob Arum don't want to pay fucking Sean Porter $2 million. He's not going to pay this nigga that much money, bro. You feel me? Even though he's a legend, he's not going to get that. And I don't think Manny Pacquiao, I think Manny Pacquiao knows what he's doing when he did that, bro. You feel me? So, like, that's my thoughts on it. You feel me? Like, I don't think that fight is going to happen. I feel like that's a next duck that he did because he don't want to fight that man, bro. You feel me? So, Charles Crawford better just fuck Manny Pacquiao and go fight um, go fight um, Sean Porter, bro. That's what I feel like. Fuck Manny Pacquiao is his, his weird-ass request, that $40 million, bro. You're not getting that, bro. You feel me? Like, I love you, man. You feel me? I feel like you're supposed to get whatever you want, bro. But during the pandemic, bro, it's just not realistic, bro. Like, if it wasn't the pandemic, then you could say whatever the fuck you want to say because you, you, you are old man, bro. You shouldn't even, you have no business to be in a ring with none of these niggas. And you giving these niggas the work. So I love Manny Pacquiao, bro. I love Manny Pacquiao to death. And I always tell niggas this, like, bro, Fleming Mayweather is the greatest boxer of all time when it comes to skills. Like, nobody could fuck with him. But career-wise, Manny Pacquiao has a better, he has a better career, bro. And 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 I'm my favorite fight of all time is me is Money Mayweather. You feel me? Then it's then it's Crawford. But come on, bro. Like Manny Pacquiao's career is crazy. Like he he's forty and he's knocking niggas out. He's beating fucking Keith Thurman. Keith Thurman is not no bum, bro. You feel me? He's forty. And he's beating. He's beating top world weights. You feel me? Like he beating them, convincing. Them, you feel me? So like. I just feel like, like this is the wrong time to ask for forty million dollars, bro. Unless it's a duck, and that's what it looked like to me. Cause I don't, I feel like you don't have no type of business being in the ring with Terence Crawford, and you know that. And I don't even think you want to be in the ring with Terence Crawford. I feel like you really want Errol Spence, cause you feel like Errol Spence is slow, slower than Crawford. His reaction time is definitely slower than Crawford's. So I feel like that's that's what you want. You want a more stationary stationary target than a nigga that's able to switch hit up. Bro, you don't want no problem, bro. You don't want no. Every time when I think about Terrence Crawford boxing, bro, I be thinking about the opponent. You don't want no problems. You don't want no problems. None of y'all want no problems, bro. Like, I'm just going to call it what it is. None of y'all want no problems with that man, bro. Y'all just be talking and y'all be saying this and y'all be saying that, but y'all really don't want no problems with him. Because if, if, if Earl Spence really wanted... Earl Spence been said he was going to fight Terrence Crawford, bro. He said after he fought Sean Paul that he was going to fight Terrence Crawford, bro. He don't want no parts. That's why you're talking about 60-40. Who are you, my man? Who are you, my man? Who are you, my man? You're not a household name, bro. Like, you you only got titles in one weight division. This nigga moved up three weight division. You feel me? Come on, my nigga. He's undisputed, bro. You're not undisputed. At all. You feel me? So you asking for 60-40, that's just you trying to disrespect. And you know that. That's what that, that's that's what I be telling you. Like these niggas, that they're 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 becoming more business minded than becoming boxers. They're smart, bro. All of these niggas tear a, 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 a page out of Mayweather book at the wrong time. Mayweather is was doing that after he realized that I'm the man, bro. Like nobody not fucking with me. Mayweather was doing that when he knows that if he retired today, I could go in the Hall of Fame. Y'all niggas is not going to the Errol Spencer not going to the Hall of Fame if you retire right now. You you only want titles in one weight division, bro. You didn't clear out two weight division then then no, you're not undisputed. You feel me? So I feel like Manny Pacquiao, that, that was just a like that was just a, a blatant duck. You feel me? To, to to start conversations so niggas can have their eye on you. You feel me? Cause you know that once niggas see that, that offer, you know that Bob Aram is not gonna pick that up and you know that Al Heyman, he probably tried to pick that up and he probably tried to negotiate it. Bob Aram is not going to negotiate $40 million with you, bro. He doesn't want to pay anybody. So I feel like that's a duck. Y'all tell me what y'all think about that. 
You feel me? I'm out. Um, I feel like Bud stop, stop Manny if the fight really happened. You feel me? And that's what I feel. Stop ducking and fight.